Welcome to TMI, Strange Airplane Disappearances, Part 1. When aircraft disappear, debris is often found quickly. However, there are a number of cases where little if any trace of the planes, passengers, or crew are ever discovered. Let's take a look at some of these. Amelia Earhart. On August 24, 25, 1932, Amelia Earhart, the famous American pilot, made history by being the first woman to fly across the United States without stopping. She then showed the world how far women could travel when she became the first female aviator to cross the Atlantic Ocean in 1928 and the first to fly solo across the pond on her own in 1932. But in July 1937, while she was traveling around the world, her twin-engine Lockheed Electroplane vanished in the Central Pacific Ocean, close to the international date line. On one of the final legs of her round-the-world journey, she set out from New Guinea with her navigator Fred Noonan. Flying out of Miami in June, it should have taken them 21 days to reach their destination. Later, nearly 250,000 square miles of ocean were searched by ships and aircraft from the U.S. Navy and Coast Guard, but Earhart and Noonan were nowhere to be found. There still exist questions about the exact circumstances surrounding her disappearance. At a time when aviation was far less reliable than it is now, theories range from a simple crash and sinking hypothesis to other possibilities like a ditch landing and survival on an island, but the pair was never located. Malaysia Airlines Flight MH370 Possibly the most notorious and recent missing aircraft. One of aviation's greatest mysteries, the Boeing 777 aircraft disappeared in 2014 while flying from Kuala Lumpur to Beijing on a scheduled route through Vietnamese airspace. The craft was carrying 239 passengers and crew members. Search teams were working to map thousands of miles of ocean floor in the hopes of finding the flight path of Malaysia Airlines Flight MH370, which claimed 239 lives. 38 minutes after takeoff, the flight lost contact with ATC, but it continued to be visible on military radar for an additional hour, during which it was observed straying westward from its intended route. Parts of the aircraft were discovered drifting thousands of miles from the aircraft's flight path in the South Indian Ocean, despite the fact that it was thought to have crashed somewhere in the Andaman Sea or South China Sea. The plane may have been intentionally flown to other islands or nations with unidentified cargo, according to some theories, or it may have been hijacked and its fuel ran out, leading to an eventual water landing. The aircraft has still not been located, and no theory has ever been validated. Air France Flight 447 The Air France Airbus flight from Paris to Rio de Janeiro disappeared in 2009. As a result of chaos and confusion on the flight, 228 people died. The wreckage and black boxes were missing for almost two years. The aircraft had been flying through a thunderstorm when it stalled and eventually crashed, as stated in a report released by the French Accident Investigation Authority. The speed sensors became frozen over, causing the autopilot to disengage. The plane's captain stepped out of the cockpit to take his mandatory crew rest and swap places with another senior pilot after the plane entered the storm, which the pilots chose not to fly around. After this, everyone on the ill-fated jet would have perished in just over 10 minutes. The first officer on the flight decided to change altitude after manually lowering airspeed into the storm. However, as airspeed decreases, so does the lift necessary to keep the aircraft airborne. Instruments immediately notified the pilot that they were in a stall, but the alert sounded more than 75 times without being addressed. As the aircraft's airspeed decreased to just 93 knots, typical airspeed is between 400 and 500 knots, the plane was climbing at a rate of 7,000 feet per minute. When the captain returned to the cockpit, it was too late. At this point, the aircraft was at only 2,000 feet 
and the terrain warning system started to go off. The captain realized they needed to pitch down to regain airspeed. The plane crashed at 2.14 off the coast of Brazil. Investigators searched one of the Atlantic Ocean's deepest regions in order to gather any information on the disappearance. Indian Air Force, Antonov. India carried out the biggest maritime search and rescue operation in its history in 2016 when 29 people were on board a military aircraft. The Indian Air Force plane, a Antonov AN-32 twin-engine turboprop transport aircraft, vanished over the Bay of Bengal. The aircraft was never located, even after ships, submarines, and aircraft were sent out. Flying Tiger Flight 739 U.S. Army Flying Tiger Flight 739, a Lockheed L-1049 Super Constellation prop liner, disappeared over the Pacific Ocean's Mariana Trench in mid-March 1962 during the early stages of the Vietnam War while en route from Guam to the Philippines. The plane was carrying three South Vietnamese passengers, 11 crew members and 93 American soldiers. They vanished into thin air on March 16, 1962. After stopping in Guam to refuel, the flight from California to Saigon vanished 80 minutes after takeoff. The search encompassed 85,000 square miles in eight days. Sadly, neither the aircraft nor any of the bodies were located or brought back. The complete failure of a massive search party that involved 1,300 personnel, 48 aircraft, and eight surface vessels failed to find any sign of the plane. Since no air traffic control centers received any distress calls, it was difficult to determine exactly when things went wrong. Investigators have connected the plane to a luminous explosion that local Standard Oil tanker crew members reported seeing in the sky about an hour after the aircraft's last communication. Speculation exists that it may have been shot down by friendly fire. Some suspect a cover-up as no government agency, not even the CIA, Army, Air Force, Pentagon, State Department, or National Archives acknowledges having any records pertaining to the mission. British South American Star Dust On the border of Argentina and Chile is the Southern Andes Mountains. On August 2, 1947, a British South American Airways Avro Lancastrian aircraft named Stardust vanished while on track to completing the last part of a connecting flight from Buenos Aires to Santiago. Air traffic controllers and investigators were perplexed because the final message a Chilean Air Force operator received was the mysterious Stendek, which was long thought to have been a typo. But more than 50 years later, in the Andes Mountains, wreckage started to surface in the late 1990s. The well-preserved body parts of the passengers on the flight were discovered under the glacial ice. A thorough investigation revealed that bad weather was the cause of the crash, despite the many rumors that circulated, ranging from alien abduction to Nazi spies and stolen gold. It also concluded that the most likely interpretation of the strange communication was based on a World War II code, which was translated as severe turbulence encountered, now descending emergency crash landing. It is thought that during their low-altitude flight over the towering Andes Mountains in preparation for their landing, the Stardust pilots must have lost sight of their location. Glenn Miller Glenn Miller was a famous band leader during the mid-20th century. By the middle of December 1944, Glenn Miller had cemented his reputation as one of the greatest big band conductors and a genuine swing genre pioneer. He became an American legend, though, when the plane he boarded vanished from sight after takeoff. The official report concluded that the Nordoin UC-64A Norseman plane must have crashed into the English Channel as a result of iced over wings or engine problems. Weather at the time was reported as cold and foggy. 
But that confusing explanation did not soothe a frightened populace that had just lost one of the Allied power's greatest sources of inspiration. Rumors about what had actually occurred spread. Theories ranged from the well-known musician covertly landing to die of cancer in a hospital to the plane being unintentionally shot down by friendly fire. Canadian Pacific DC-4 a Canadian Pacific Airlines Douglas DC-4, carrying 37 passengers, including members of the Army and Air Force, departed Vancouver for Tokyo on July 21, 1951. The aircraft encountered strong winds and icy conditions while en route to a stopover in Anchorage, Alaska. The adverse weather conditions caused the flight to deviate from its intended course. After its disappearance, a rescue effort was initiated since the Douglas DC-4 did not show up. On October 31, 1951, the search was canceled following a three-month period during which both Canadian and American aircraft participated. No trace was ever found. One more inventive theory is that the Alaska Triangle claimed yet another flight. Flight 404, a Fokker F. 27 Friendship owned by Pakistan International Airlines Flight 404 vanished without a trace on August 25, 1989, shortly after takeoff. It is believed to have killed all 54 passengers on. Flight 404 was en route to Islamabad, the capital of Pakistan. It is believed that Flight 404 went down somewhere in the Himalayan mountains, an area that is both breathtaking and treacherous. With prompt action, the Pakistani government assembled land search parties and aerial search teams made up of both military and civilian personnel. No trace of flight 404 has ever been found, and because of the treacherous conditions in the Himalayas, it's doubtful that flight 404 or her passengers will ever be found. These are just some of the strange aircraft disappearances from around the world. Each is shrouded in its own mystery of where and what happened. Look for part two of our strange airplane disappearances. Please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more.